Head to the gunsmith or scavenge supplies by that clock shop. 20 minutes. 15 minutes. 15 minutes now, bid 14. Bid 14. Your boys got the opposite. You've got nothing on your team. I bid 9. Don't you see what the Bible popular is selling? They're selling dreams. And dreams, my friend. They don't come cheap. Poster. There's another cipher on it. Huh. So we need to find the code book? Yes. Hmm. Looks like everything's impounded at the Good Time Club. Maybe that's where we'll find it. Onto this. I found some money. Want it? Here's some cash. That'll do. Can you get this open? I've never even seen a lock like this. Anti-pressure device, a spring-loaded wiper, a relocker. You'd need a battering ram to open it. Here it is, Booker. Chen Lin, gunsmith. I have a pressing need to speak to this so-called false shepherd, stirring up so much trouble. We got enough problems without this damn fool shooting up the city and blaming it all on the Vox. Though if he's amiable, yeah, yeah, he might be just the fellow we need for our immediate concerns.
Doesn't look like we can enter now. Go ahead. I'll be fine. <laughs> Gautama Buddha. Who? The founder of Buddhism. Spent 49 days under a Bodhi tree until he achieved enlightenment. Something tells me Comstock doesn't cater to idols getting worship that ain't him. Hello? Hello? Mr. Lin? Chen Lin? Is anybody here? What happened here? Someone worked this place over. Local constabulary, no doubt. <laughs> Do you hear that? There's someone downstairs. Excuse me. Man, I'm sorry to bother you. you are looking for Mr. Lin? Mr. Chen Lin? Booker. Mr. Lin, not here. He... gone. Gone? They take... flying squad. I pray, Gautama Buddha. Pray, give husband back. Give back to Mei Lin. Where did they take him? Club. Everyone take to good time club. Where is this club? <laughs> Ma'am, please, where, where is this club? Booker will find it. Just leave her be. Why not Vox Bully help Chen Lin? Why not Daisy Fitzroy help Chen Lin? Cops, it's the kind who probably got their boot on Lin's throat asking him how well he knows Daisy Fitzroy. Isn't she the one we're working for? As a matter of fact, it is. All right, now let's figure out where this good time club is.
much care for you, Mr. DeWitt. I must admit, you know your way around a brawl. Sorry about what I said at the docks. I'm calling you a thug. Yeah. Can't see how I might have changed your sense of that. You protected me. Job's a job. Hold on to this? Huh. One day, ain't nobody noticed me. Then they think I done for Lady Comstock, and well, everybody noticed me. I head to Finkton, and I hide. I hide deep. The more they look, deeper I go. Only thing a color child can count on is the fact they're invisible. that song before. I don't suspect anyone's heard that song.
Here it is, Mr. DeWitt. Now we just need to head inside and find Mr. Lin. And just call me Booker. More money. Cash. Let's find Shen Lin and get the hell out of here. Now, now, all I ask is that you finish what you started to it. Wouldn't want to disappoint the other applicants. Our first candidate is a veteran of Peking. Now, Go what ahead. do they sure say thing. about old soldiers? <laughs> Frankly, my money's on you. He's something of an old hand at handling explosives. Only man I know who hasn't <laughs> lost a limb working with them. <laughs> Yet. Ha! Thanks! Yes! yes. Quite the ego confer, isn't he? We're getting a the results! Themselves. Pick this one up at a hiring fair for a song.
is an expert with the automata. Wants to replace Elizabeth. Okay. security with machines. I'll give the old boy credit, though. It would be fewer mouths to feed. <laughs> interested in your job, Fink. Now, now, I know all about your little job for Fitzroy. But do you really want to take her offer over mine? Do you know how many people would kill to be head of Fink security? <laughs> You're a tough nut to crack, Mr. DeWitt. A tough nut. <laughs> but I promise you this. I will get what I want. There's a door over here. I think that's the way down. Look, 
Chen Lin, cell number nine. Hmm. Got a lock here. Let me have a look. I used to work for folks like Fink. Really? And I was with the Pinkertons. They call us in when the workers got restless. To do what? Demonstrate the folly of men striking, throwing down tools. You hurt people. I'll tell you this. Sometimes there's precious need for folks like Fitzroy. Why? Because of folks like me. All done. No point hiding. for the clock shop. Tell us what you know about Fitzroy, you goddamn gook. We know you can hear us. You want to say something? Or you want us to bring in Mrs. Lynn for company? Uh, throw a bucket of ice water on him. We got three more to bring in tonight. to deserve to be locked up in a place like this. Fink don't need much of a reason. No. No, he doesn't. It's Slate. He looks... You were right. Sparing him was no mercy. Picked. Keep a lookout. Got it. Think you can pick this? Okay. This is it, isn't it? Yep. Number nine. Do it? You're a liar. But you can't blame me for looking after my own interests, can you? Need money? Now I know Fitzroy has come calling, but I think you'll find your business with her has come to an end. <laughs> lions walk with lions, do it? Not hyenas!
too late. God damn it. Hank, this is what he meant. Now we need to find someone else to make those guns. No. Dead is dead, Elizabeth. Dead is dead. What? How the hell did... I see heads. And I see tails. It's all a matter of perspective. Why are you following us? Who sent you? Comstock? What do you want? What do you see here from this angle? Dead. Listen. And that angle? Alive. Walker. Chen Lin. This is big. The body's gone. It was never here. It's another Columbia. A different Columbia. The same coin. A different perspective. Heads. Tails. Dead. Alive. We have to go through to this other Columbia, but how? It's like riding a bicycle. One never really forgets. One just needs the courage to climb aboard. If we go into the stair, I don't think I'll be able to bring us back. Are you sure you're ready? Okay, open it. No blood. And no body. It's another world, Booker. Another Columbia. Something tells me one dead gunsmith ain't the only thing that's changed. says cut him loose. They're bringing his tools to the lockup. They'll keep him clean, I guess. Why? What are you, the Columbia Gazette? The chink's wife got friends in high places. Come on, we need to sell. I don't understand how Chen Lin is alive now. We're in a world where he was never murdered. Somewhere we'll find out why, I suppose. I don't suspect you can change something like that and have everything else remain the same. Disgusting. 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 Disgus
disgusting. some cash. Got it. Found a lockpick. Electric.
need a lock picked. Let me have a look. Done. 